Hey, what's up guys? This is Kashai here. I'm coming to you with another video just keeping you updated during this beautiful summer of 2012. What can I say? Right now, I am a 24-year-old. I just turned 24 years old last month, June 4th, and first things first, I'd just like to say that I'm very fortunate and I'm very happy to still be alive and still be here, and I don't take any day for granted. I've been working so much on just becoming a better person and working on my health and trying to keep those creative juices flowing I actually kind of hit a writer's block a blogger's block I just had a huge block and I was just so lost and not really able to get my thoughts together and keep things organized but now I'm at the point where I was able to focus on my priorities, pull my socks up in my sleeves and get to work and just get things done. Of course, to me, progress is every aspect of your life. When I think of my progress, I, w I mean, I want to be number one. I don't want to just have money or just have a car or just have you know someone on my arm I want to have a well-rounded steady foundation and be a true success and I want to be successful based on my own merits for example I'm the employee of the month at work and I may not be the fastest or the quickest and I definitely don't have the longest experience there but I am a very honest person I am willing to work I am very good at taking constructive criticism and I know if a task needs to be done I will do it I'm I, I just need to work on being more open with my communication and giving 110 percent and of course with me being a vegetarian I've definitely been trying to cook more and learn more recipes and look at my nutrition facts and nutrition labels more I cannot eat a lot of sodium and I also like to stay away from a lot of sugar because it's just because something's vegetarian for me doesn't necessarily mean that it's always healthy so also just writing more reading more I would love to do a, a documentary or a write-up of some sort something on cooking vegetarian dishes and the health benefits and just being a vegetarian here in South Florida and I guess just my story as it pertains to my life and you know I want to also mention that this year has been a huge spiritual breakthrough for me I feel like we are so accustomed to having to grow up in a church or a temple or a mosque or in a community where people follow the same faith but there's a lot of hypocrisy Hip, hip, hypocrisy and there's a lot of discrimination and there's a lot of just demeaning ways that a lot of the more conservative extremist way of thinking kind of separates us and is very sensationalized and I've, I found my own relationship in, with my spirituality by like not going but not following the book like I had to kind of step away from going to services and listening to what other people say because my relationship with God or the higher power or a higher being or my spirit and my soul I had to find it on my own and that goes with everything in life you have to make it your own you cannot always listen to what other people tell you you cannot believe everything you see because a lot of things are deceptive and you have to know in your heart what you feel is right and just as a human being have some sort of compassion and common sense and I, I just believe in taking control completely whatever you do every day ask yourself what am I doing why am I doing this do I need this how badly do I need this what better can I do with my life how can I make my life more fulfilling ask yourself questions stop going through each day just living to live it's not enough for me like I said when I want to be a success and what success is to me it's it's well-rounded I mean it's it's spiritual physical financial mental 
emotional, sexual, whatever it may be. It's it's on all levels taking control, you know. And just like this week, I've I've gone to the dentist and I've gone to the bank trying to get my finances even better because I have so many great plans in the future. I also, you know, I'm going to go to the 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 eye doctor because I badly need to get my glasses back. I'm also going to be looking into getting going back to college. I'm getting my transcript and I'm going to do the whole registering process. I'm so excited about that. And I'm also saving for a vacation that I'm going to, you know, and saving for some concerts that are coming up in the next few weeks. And also just looking forward to opportunities that I, I've worked hard for through youth organizations and volunteering in social work because I do see myself having a future in some way shape or form by being involved with the community and I think everybody should get involved with their community we all have so much to offer and we complain about things not being the way we want it to be or we're unhappy with things well then why then can't we take the power and do something about it duh like come on now don't be dumb don't act brand new if you want to change something, do something about it. Don't wait for it. Make it happen. So, I'm just looking forward to pushing myself and questioning myself and improving because I believe there's always room for progression. I have not seen my greatest potential yet and I'm going to keep pushing. You all haven't even seen the best of your own potentials. So just keep pushing guys. Stay focused, stay healthy, stay happy bless you and love yourselves, love each other, and I will be seeing you all soon. Take it easy.